Hello Internet Explorers! Ignore the hat today, I'm having a really bad hair day. I just want to say before we get into it today, Happy Mother's Day. Um, I'm filming this during Sunday, so it's Mother's Day for me right now. So Happy Mother's Day to all the mothers out there. Especially shout out to my own mother who I know watches my videos and is my biggest fan. Um, she's the reason why I started traveling. She is the travel bug in our family and she bit all the children and now my sister, my brother, and I have her to thank for all these wonderful adventures that we go on ever since we were little. So thank you, Mom. Now, on to the good stuff! So today I want to talk to you about this thing I signed up for called Post Crossing. Um, it's kind of like a pen pal program, but instead of one specific pen pal, you're a pen pals with the world. How it works is that every time you register to send out a card, they give you a special registration number that you write onto the postcard, and then whoever receives it can put that registration number into the website, and once that's registered, you are in line to get the next postcard. So it's kind of, you get what you give. So when you sign up, you write a little bio about yourself, introducing who you are, and also what kind of postcards you like. Some people like me say they like maps, infographics, designing ones. Other people like photos. Some people like stuff with flowers on it or landmarks. Some people also include what they want you to write. Some people say, hey, um, write about how your day was, write a little bit about yourself. The most interesting one I got was actually they asked for the price of milk for where you live. Just as a comparison, which I thought was great because like, you know, years later you can look back on it and be like, oh my god, the price of milk was so cheap. This is my first one. Um, it's from California. And I know, exotic land. And I, I thought it was really cool because she actually told me about her day. She was a little sick, but her friend bought her soup. And I thought that was really cute and charming. This one I got from a girl in Mexico, which I thought was really cute. This one is cuteness overlord. Overlord? Sorry, overload. Why did I say overlord? I, don't, I haven't even played StarCraft in so many years. Hmm. This one, it's a card from the Netherlands. How cute is this? It's not just the design that's cute. Do you know what's also cute about this? It's from a child. I mean, I read this and um, it's actually this teacher in this classroom in the Netherlands signed up the class as one account for post crossing. So every postcard they receive, you're actually sending it to the school and they send one back and it's just so cute. I will say because you are leaving an address for people to send you cards to, um, keep it safe. Don't reveal too much personal information. I myself have the postcard sent to my office so that there is some layer of privacy just because I do have this website as well and people do read my blog. I encourage you guys to sign up and try it because it's a really good program. You don't have to pay for membership. It's completely free. It's based off of donations. All the postcards that I've gotten so far, I'm going to put on my blog. So check my website for all the scans and I'm going to put a little description on where I got it from. I'm not going to say who I got it from just because I kind of do want to keep it anonymous and that's the fun of it, you know? So that's it for today. Um, this is my video. Um, I'm going to go and fix my hair and enjoy the rest of my Sunday and I'll see you guys next week.